I'm Dr. Eldad Farhi. I'm a counseling and psychotherapeutic psychologist. I run psychologyexpert.co.uk and today I will be talking about psychology. Biological psychology is that aspect of psychology that looks mostly into the effects biology has on psychology and vice versa. To give you a couple of examples, we like fatty and sugary foods. This is because our bodies respond better to those foods. They contain more calories and therefore we've evolved a predilection for those particular types of foods. That predilection was really useful in olden days when we had to expend lots of calories to find that food. Of course, liking sugary and fatty foods ensured that we spent our calories looking for the most rewarding type of food and therefore that we would survive. What has become a problem is today where food is quite easily obtainable, but the predilection continues, causing almost an epidemic of obesity within the affluent world. So biological psychology would look first, why do we do something? What are the biological imperatives for doing it? And secondly, how by using psychological methods we can change our behavior. Therefore, biological psychology is a study of the interface between body and mind. The problem with biological psychology is that it is not as plain as it sounds. For instance, you may have heard of the selfish gene theory, that is the idea that our behavior is mostly mandated by our unconscious, biologically fixed sort of tendency to pass on our genes to the future, to preserve the bloodline. However, the theory that sounds very simple and on the face of it quite true, cannot explain things such as altruistic behavior. People actually will give up their life in order to save other people, not even related to them. Obviously, selfish genes therefore cannot explain all of our behavior. Biological psychology often offers mechanistic, simple explanations to our behavior based on our biology. However, as the fallacy with the selfish gene theory has showed, we often act for far more complex reasons which have little to do with our biology.